so in this question it is asked to find the area of the yellow shaded region so by common sense one can say that let me first compute this area area of this big semicircle then subtract the area of this semicircle then also subtract the area of this semicircle so the remaining area will be the area of yellow shaded region and that will be our approach so first of all let us assume that the radius of this biggest semicircle is capital r and let this be small r1 and this be small r2 let me clean the board now area of yellow shaded region can be written as area of this big semicircle with radius capital r that will be pi times capital r square divided by 2 this is a semicircle so we have to divided by 2 minus let me put everything in the bracket area of this semicircle so this will be pi times radius is r1 square divided by 2 again because it is a semicircle plus because we have already used bracket here pi times r2 square upon 2 that means area of this semicircle now let us simplify this so this will be pi by 2 r square minus we can take out pi by 2 common from both the terms so this will be r1 square plus r2 square let me clean the diagram now let us assume that this distance is x so what we are going to do is first of all let us focus on this length so this length is capital r so here capital r can be written as r2 and then again this will be r2 so 2r2 plus x so we can write like this 2r2 plus x so from here we can write r2 is equal to capital r minus x divided by 2 likewise if we focus here this distance from here to here this is r then this distance is x so capital r plus x equals you see here this is the capital r distance the radius of this big semicircle plus x can be written as twice r1 this is r1 so this distance will also be r1 so we can write twice r1 so from here r1 will be capital r plus x divided by 2 now we will substitute small r2 small r1 here in the equation so we will get pi by 2 capital r square minus pi by 2 in place of r1 square we can substitute r plus x upon 2 whole square plus in place of r2 we can write capital r minus x by 2 whole square simplifying this so pi by 2 capital r square minus pi by we can do one thing we can take out 4 from here because this will be r plus x whole square upon 2 squared 2 squared will be 4 so 4 times 2 will be 8 here outside and inside we can write r plus x whole square plus r minus x whole square let us further simplify this so this will be pi by 2 capital r square minus pi by 8 in bracket now we will expand this so this will give us r square plus x square plus 2 r x likewise this will give us r square plus x square minus 2 r x so these two terms will get cancelled and we will be left with pi by 2 capital r square minus pi by 8 r square 
plus r square will be 2r square plus x square plus x square will give us 2x square. This will be pi upon 2 capital R square minus because 2 is common in both the terms we can take it outside we can take common and then divide it by 8. So this will give us pi by 4 capital R square plus x square. Now let me clean the board. So this will be equal to pi by 2 capital R square minus pi by 4 capital R square minus pi by 4 x square. We have opened the bracket. So if we solve the first two terms, this will give us pi by 4 capital R square and pi by 4 x square will remain as it is. We can again take pi by 4 common and inside it will be capital R square minus x square. So this is an expression for the area of this yellow shaded region. Now we have to substitute the value of r square minus x square here in order to get that area. So for that we will do one construction in the figure. So let me clean the figure first of all. The construction is to join these two points. So this distance will represent capital R. This distance is 2 and this distance we assumed as x. So using Pythagorean theorem, we can write capital R square is equal to 2 squared plus x square. That means 4 plus x square. We can shift x square to LHS. So we will get R square minus x square equals 4. Now we can substitute this r square minus x square's value here which is equal to 4. So this will be equal to pi by 4 multiplied with this can be replaced by 4. So 4 and 4 gets cancelled and we will be left with pi. So the area of this yellow shaded region will be pi square units. So if you want to get more such videos, do subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video.